Look at every single component of the vehicle and reduce the weight as a full design study of a concept vehicle. We're taking a full-size sedan and making it the weight of a small, compact vehicle. Within Ford Research, we've actually been working on lightweight vehicles for many, many years. Ten years ago today, we were commissioned to design and develop the Ford GT Supercar. And it was all light waiting for speed. Fast forward to today, the research experts in this building are delivering F-150. It is Ford tough. It is built tough. It's durable. We're talking about advanced high strength steels for the chassis. Provide the durability and the strength where you need it. The light weighting for the aluminum structure, the doors, the cab, the bed. It's all about light weighting the vehicle in totality. Now when you take that concept of light weighting the F-150, it's the same thing about the concept vehicle behind me. Look at every single component of the vehicle. This is a cast iron brake rotor. If we make the jump to an aluminum brake rotor, we're taking about 38% weight out. This is an oil pan. Normally it's made out of a cast aluminum. We are making it out of a carbon fiber composite, a carbon fiber wheel, and also a lightweight tire. We currently make solid steel springs in the front of the vehicle. We're looking at composite springs. Lighter weight, currently under test for durability. A lot of the technologies that you're seeing demonstrated on this vehicle are not ready for high volume production, but the message around this vehicle is it could be built into a high volume capable product. Light weighting does not come for free. We're getting very good at looking how to offset the cost by consolidating parts and using next generation manufacturing processes. It's really about taking out weight to improve fuel efficiency, reducing CO2 emissions, basically making a good product even better.